On July 3rd, 1969, the Soviet Union's dreams of a moon rocket went up in smoke and fire on the launch pad as the largest explosion of any rocket in history. The Soviet N-1 rocket booster was a giant rocket meant to carry objects or people beyond Earth orbit, basically to the moon. Its first stage is the most powerful single stage of any rocket ever made, and that includes the American counterpart, the Saturn V. The five-stage monster N-1 rockets were 344 feet tall and almost 56 feet in diameter. Weighing in at over 6 million pounds, they were designed for a payload of 200,000 pounds into low Earth orbit, or 58,000 pounds past Earth orbit. The heavy lift rockets were expected to carry out reconnaissance of possible landing spots on the moon and then carry manned flights there. Unfortunately for the Soviet space program, all four attempted launches resulted in failure, with the launch of July 3rd, 1969, resulting in a giant explosion that destroyed the launch pad. Investigations showed that a loose bolt was sucked into an oxygen pump, causing the rocket motors to automatically shut down and the rocket to fall from its maximum lift off of nearly 200 meters. It took a year and a half just to rebuild the launch pad, putting the Soviets far behind in the space race. When the United States successfully landed on the moon and returned the crew safely in July of 1969, the Soviet space program was given other priorities. The four failed launch attempts of the N-1 would be their only missions, and no more would be built. We cannot say how much each of these rockets and the destruction of the launch pad cost in terms of money, but it certainly had to be a lot. Money that could have been used for all sorts of humanitarian purposes other than racing the U.S. to the moon. The bottom line is, space programs are incredibly expensive. As a question for my students and subscribers, are they worth it? What should their priorities be? Please let us know what you think in the comments section below this video. If you like this video and would like to receive notification of new videos, please feel welcome to subscribe to History and Headlines and become one of our patrons. Your viewership is much appreciated.